We can live without religion and meditation, but we cannot survive without human affection. The best relationship is one in which your love for each other exceeds your need for each other. Remember that sometimes not getting what you want is a wonderful stroke of luck. As you breathe in, cherish yourself. As you breathe out, cherish all beings. True change is within. Leave the outside as it is. We can never obtain peace in the outer world until we make peace with ourselves. To conquer oneself is a greater victory than to conquer thousands in a battle. Real change in the world will only come from a change of heart. Don't let a little dispute injure a great relationship. Take into account that great love and great achievements involve great risk. Although you may not always be able to avoid difficult situations, you can modify the extent to which you can suffer by how you choose to respond to the situation. The quality of what we do depends on our motivation, which is why we have to learn how to cultivate a compassionate mind. As individuals, we can influence our own families. Our families can influence our communities and our communities can influence our nations. Open your arms to change, but don't let go of your values. The more you are motivated by love, the more fearless and free your actions will be. There are only two days in the year that you can do nothing about. One is called yesterday and the other is called tomorrow. But today is the right day to love, believe, do and mostly live. Happiness is not something ready-made. It comes from your own actions. A disciplined mind leads to happiness and an undisciplined mind leads to suffering. The inner peace of an alert and calm mind is the source of real happiness and good health. Happiness doesn't always come from a pursuit. Sometimes it comes when we least expect it. We need to learn to want what we have not to have what we want. Our prime purpose in life is to help others. And if you can't help them, at least don't hurt them. Let us reflect what is truly of value in life, what gives meaning to our lives, and set our priorities on the basis of that. Once a year, go somewhere you've never been before. Know the rules well so you can break them effectively. Judge your success by what you had to give up in order to get it. My religion is very simple. My religion is kindness. The true hero is one who conquers his own anger and hatred. Someone else's action should not determine your response. 
I defeat my enemies when I make them my friends. In the practice of tolerance, one's enemy is the best teacher. Optimism leads to success. Pessimism leads to defeat. Anger is the ultimate destroyer of your own peace of mind. In order to carry out a positive action, we must develop a positive vision. Just one small positive thought in the morning can change your whole day. A heart full of love and compassion is the main source of inner strength, willpower, happiness, and mental tranquility. Don't ever mistake my silence for ignorance, my calmness for acceptance, or my kindness for weakness. Compassion and tolerance are not a sign of weakness, but a sign of strength. When we meet real tragedy in life, we can react in two ways, either by losing hope and falling into self-destructive habits, or by using the challenge to find our inner strength. Tragedy should be utilized as a source of strength. No matter what sort of difficulties, how painful the experience is, if we lose our hope, that's our real disaster. Love and compassion are necessities, not luxuries. Without them, humanity cannot survive. Scientists have a special responsibility, a moral responsibility, in ensuring that science serves the interest of humanity in the best possible way. World peace must develop from inner peace. Peace is not the mere absence of violence. Peace is, I think, the manifestation of human compassion. Do not let the behavior of others destroy your inner peace. I am a man of religion, but religion alone cannot answer all our problems. The purpose of all the major religious traditions is not to construct big temples on the outside, but to create temples of goodness and compassion inside, in our hearts. Cultivating a close, warm-hearted feeling for others automatically puts the mind at ease. People take different roads seeking fulfillment and happiness. Just because they're not on your road doesn't mean they've gotten lost. Love is the absence of judgment. The remedy is to look deeper and recognize that we human beings are physically, mentally, and emotionally the same. The planet does not need more successful people. The planet desperately needs more peacemakers, healers, restorers, storytellers, and lovers of all kinds. In order to become prosperous, a person must initially work very hard, so he or she has to sacrifice a lot of leisure time. 